Hello and welcome to the Drivers Hub. My name is Bhavneet Aswani and this is my car, an Audi A4 3 liter TDI. Today we're going to be doing a Kitna Deti Hai with it, which is a little special day for me because I have not taken it on the expressway yet at full chat and in full roadworthiness. So we're going to see how does the car perform on the expressway where it's supposed to be at home and see how much mileage do I actually get when the car is in its comfort zone. just hit the expressway and uh, our drive to the expressway is not that long from our office so we have not been able to actually encounter very heavy traffic yet so that's good news for my instant uh, mileage we are, get, we are getting maybe 14.5 kilometers a li uh, liter currently as per what the computer is telling us and uh, currently we are just cruising at 80 kilometers an hour and the mileage uh, indicator is only increasing so we are only going to be facing a little bit of mileage drop whilst entering the city and uh, it all depends on the amount of traffic uh, as to how much we are going to be getting from the car at the end of the trip so we are going to be getting to experience the highway and the city traffic and we are going to be able to get a good average as to what does this car actually do kitna deti hai so yeah let's continue the day looks pretty nice and the traffic is not that bad so it's going to be a good drive update we have just crossed lonavla's exit and uh, we are about to hit the ghats so as of now we were cruising at 100 kilometers an hour which is the speed limit uh, with my cruise control on and uh, we have achieved 15.3 kilometers a liter of average uh, according to the onboard computer which is pretty good and uh, now what i'm expecting is uh, a little bit of traffic at the ghats and of course we're going to be breaking quite a bit uh, and uh, losing quite a lot of momentum so we're going to be dropping uh, a little bit of mileage but let's see how bad it is i'm pretty sure it's not going to be that bad. taken a small break at the just before the second toll and uh, few, weirdly enough very weirdly enough we actually got more mileage from the ghats i don't know why that is maybe it's because i was chilling at lower revs maybe at 1500 rpm and uh, shifting down to maybe fourth or fifth max keeping the highest gear possible at the lowest revs possible uh, we got a whopping 17.8 kilometers a liter reaching here but now the bigger challenge arrives which is after that toll that's going to be Mumbai city we don't know how the traffic is going to be but judging by the amount of traffic that is there on the expressway today Bombay is going to look a little tough we're going to be chilling in lower gears and we're going to be in sta uh, standstill traffic for quite a while which is going to be pretty bad and uh, word of advice 
This might give a lot of mileage while cruising down the expressway, but higher displacement engines do not like traffic. They just start chugging fuel like crazy. And we are going to get to witness that in a bit. So we have not even entered Mumbai, we are just at the second toll and this is the state of traffic. We are going to be here for a good 5 minutes and uh, I expect my mileage to drop. But the car has been surprising me quite a bit throughout the entire trip. Even during the ghats when we had to slow down, the car was doing pretty well. So uh, let's see, it is dropping by the minute. So let's see what kind of range do we get while entering Mumbai. We've got a little small patch. Let's try and get the most out of it. entering Mumbai after maybe a three hour drive with a stop. We have achieved 17.5 kilometers per litre throughout the highway which is pretty commendable and we weren't driving super uh, responsibly or super recklessly. We were just driving how normal cars should be driven. Not with the specific motive of getting the most out of the car. You're cruising at 100 and that is basically what you're going to be doing on the highway. So yeah, 17.5 is a pretty decent number, but uh, let's see, we've got an hour left and 35 kilometers left, we're going to Thane. So we are going to be encountering quite a lot of traffic. I have still not been phased or the car has never been, not been phased the entire trip with uh, some stops, some hindrances in the expressway, but yeah, we're doing pretty well, quite optimistic. So we have almost reached, we are 20 minutes away, 7 kilometers away and uh, we have covered most of the dirty part of traffic. It was bad, I'm not gonna lie, but uh, the car did fantastically. We are currently showing a reading of 16.1 kilometers a liter, which is a 1.1 kilometers a liter drop. Honestly, that is not that bad at all. However, uh, I think if you drive it in the city and only in the city, you're not going to be getting these numbers. The drop is going to be much bigger. And you also can't fathom the amount of fuel this car chugs in city traffic. I do not know if these uh, figures are going to be that accurate given that we have done a 200 kilometer trip at constant speed all the time from Pune. So, the city numbers are a little skewed, however, 16.1 kilometers a litre on an average with pretty much one hour of traffic in a city and two hours of expressway is a very livable number. So there you go guys, a pretty straightforward question, Kitna deti hai? and it is 15.6 kilometers per litre on an average, including highways and quite a bit of uh, start and stop traffic all the way to Thane from uh, Vashi. So we did a pretty good fair shake of the car. The car drives fantastically and we know that it's running pretty good. So this stays true to its name of a highway stormer. It felt at home and it was super quiet. I had quite a good time and a pretty nice drive all the way here. The car was very comfortable and uh, now it's time to take rest because we've got a long day ahead of us tomorrow you guys will see soon see you bye bye